Good day and welcome back to my channel. This is the Queen Phoenix. Today's video is a textured hexagon motif. It has six sides. Extremely quick and easy to do. Let's quickly do this. You need your yarn and your hook. Whichever yarn you choose to use is your choice. As long as you have an appropriate size hook. I'd like to invite you, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please hit subscribe. This channel is updated weekly with free tutorials and free patterns, just like the one I'm doing now. If you are a returning viewer, hit that, like, hit that subscribe button. For this pattern, you'll need to start with a magic ring or a magic, ma or a magic circle. And you're going to chain five. This chain five counts as one double crochet and a two chain space. Into the same, same circle, you're going to put three double crochets. So that's one, two, three. Chain two. You're going to repeat this five more times so that you have six sides to your work. So it's three double crochets and two chains. You will, once you're at the end of your row, you will make two more double crochet. Oops. And you're going to slip stitch into your initial three chain, but the third one from the top. And you're going to pull your magic ring, but not too much at this stage. You'll see that your project is slightly ruffled. So do not worry, it will, it will, what do you call it? It will flatten out as you work. Slip stitch into your chain two space. For row two, please chain six. This counts as one double crochet and three chain. Into your same space, this chain two space, you're going to work three double crochets. It's one, two, three. Work in the chain two spaces only. So in your next ch chain two space, you're going to make three double crochets, three chain, three double crochets. And you're going to repeat this, three double crochets, three chain, three double crochets in each of your chain two spaces and I'll meet you at the end. When you get to your end where you have your six chain stitches in the same space before the six chain, please make two more double crochets. And slip stitch into the third chain from the beginning of the previous row. Slip stitch into that chain space. For row three, chain six again. Into the same space, please make three double crochets. Two, three, one treble, which is yarn over twice. chain one. You're only going to work in the three chain spaces of the previous row and this is your repeat for the rest of your row. It is one treble so you're going to start with one treble in your three chain space, three double crochets, Chain three, 
three double crochets into the same space and one treble into the exact same space chain one you will repeat that once twice thrice four five times and I'm going to meet you when you're done with your fifth one you would have gone right around now where you have your six chain you're going to work right next to that in the same space you'll make one treble and two double crochets and you're going to slip stitch in the third chain from the bottom and there you have it all done thank you so much for watching I'll get you on the next video happy crocheting this is the Queen Phoenix out